Antichrist. Mitt Romney's a liberal. Fig Newton Gingrich is a well, he's a Stay Puft Marshmallow Man. I am voting for Ron Paul in 2012. We failed at everything else. Okay? We have failed at everything else. You people voted for Barack Hussein Obama because you wanted a change and you got zero change. You vote in Rick Perry or Mitt Romney or Newt Gingrich, uh, Fig, uh, Fig Newt Gingrich, the Fig Newton. Well, he's a Stay Puft Marshmallow Man. Change. No change whatsoever. None. It's going to be all the same. They all work for the same people. They don't work for you. They don't work for me. They vote for the, or they work for themselves. They work for the bankers. That's who they're in it for. Not you or me or anyone. And to vote for these people is voting for war. Obama's taking troops out of Iraq and putting them in other countries that were going to war. And, you know, under, under the smoke screen of NATO, okay, that's still us, okay? Newsflash. Oh, it's NATO forces. Well, guess what? We are NATO, NATO forces. How many military bases are in the Middle East? How many of them? You've got at least 20 that is centered around the country of Iran. Around at least 20. I, I may even say even more than that. I mean, just around the, the country of Iran and the country surrounding Iran. And, um, and then you got people worried about what Iran's going to do. Well, don't they feel a little threatened by us because we have so many bases around them? I mean, I'd be threatened if China had bases all around us. Yeah, I'd be a little threatened too. I'd be trying to get a nuclear warhead. Best thing for Iran is for us to leave them alone. Leave all these countries alone. Now all these guys want to go to war. That's all they want. Perry, go to war. Let's go to war. Newt, let's go to war. Mitt, let's go to war. War, war, bang, 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 shoot them up, spend more money. This is a new thing for me, wearing sunglasses at night time. Can we, can we figure out a way to have a president who will work for us and work for our country. I think we can if people give Ron Paul a, a, you know, a valid chance. You will never see my eyes again after this video. One thing I don't understand about how people discredit Ron Paul, they say he's a good guy and he make a good president. But, nothing comes good after the but, okay? Vote him in. This primary election, vote for Ron Paul. I mean, who who, who you going to vote for? I asked a question here a few weeks ago, and, and I never really got very many responses from people uh, because maybe they're afraid of talking politics on YouTube. Or on the internet. And I think that's a real lame excuse. I think everybody needs to know where their money is going. Where they go up, show up on, uh, you know, on Super Tuesday, and they just vote well. I'm gonna vote for him because I heard his name a lot mentioned on TV. Don't vote if you're that person. Do you know how people are gonna vote, or does the news tell you? And truckers. Y'all need to vote. There's like three million truck drivers or something like that. I mean, there's millions of truck drivers on the road. 
less than 5% of us vote. We need to vote. And, I, and I'm going to... I'm tired of the police state. I'm tired of having them when I go to an airport. You know, someone going to fill up my pants, fill down my pants. I believe if Ron Paul is president, you'll get less intrusion with the government and let us get out here and work, make money. And that's everybody. Small businesses, large businesses, less regulation, less taxes. It's amazing to me to see how many people like Rick Perry because they don't know where he's from. He's from Texas. He's a good old boy. Oh, okay. Fine. Rick Perry is the Antichrist. And then when they say, when um, you have Rick Perry, you know, wanting to put needles in our daughters pump them full of drugs. Everyone's ready to give them a free pass on that. But they can't give Ron Paul a free pass for being, you know, for liberty. What is up? That's my two cents for what it's worth. 73. Thanks for watching.